Hello and welcome back to this Cosmic Star Heroine Let's Play with me, SLJRPG. In the last episode, we took on, um, we went around the Skyox village, found the Cybes at the top of the infected hive, which is here, and we also went and defeated the Black Squirrel in what I assume is a little side dungeon. Uh, but in today's episode, nothing much has changed. I've gone ahead and changed the abilities of some of these guys. Um, they'll come up on the thing, and I decided to bring Finn with me, even though I really disliked him last time. I thought, fuck it, Chan wasn't really doing her bet, so let's bring another gun wielder to us. But... Into the hive mind we go. What a strange place. I think the screamers used to live here. But there's no time for sightseeing. We have to reach the top of the tower and get the Lunamua drive back. We certainly do, but... There's going to be some time for some sighting. Looks like a battery could go here. So that's our first thing. We got these weird scorpion things. Uh, friendly, but not your friend. Uh... We'll do this because I want to use RNG. Let's see what this does. Random amount of damage, 248. Okay, that's fine. Uh, we got an ice damage, but we also have got Molotov here, which is just straight up fire damage, which is good. And then let's do fire damage. Nice. It seems like the enemies we're going to be seeing here are going to be weak to fire, so that's always good. We'll do final blow. Then let's go ahead and do a... We brought Reboot as well. And do to us and fix stun on all enemies. So that'd be fine. But let's just go ahead and do a fire. Then with this... Let's do a chill vial. Boom. Easily done. That was certainly way less weak than the things we had encountered in other uh, areas. These doors here. Can we get a battery from here? Is this what we need to grab? Can we see anything that we can examine, perhaps? Repair. You repair the damaged wire. Very nice. We'll take that. So I'm guessing this way is going to be the way that we have to go in order to get ourselves the battery. Ooh, there's two batteries. Take the blue battery. You try to take it, but it doesn't budge. Okay. Put the battery in the slot. Can we take this one with us now? Hmm. Okay. Good to know. Perhaps we missed something there. We've got some more crabby robot things. This does not open, unfortunately. This does not open, unfortunately. We do have a translator for us, which is good. But all these hives, which is nice to see. We'll take the blue battery. Okay. Then let's go fight these crab things. Uh, what are these things going to be weak against? Ice and rock. We'll do a water damaged wall. Why not? Let's do an RNG. Uh, let's start off with the ice attack with the drone. We've got a Molotov here, so let's go ahead and just use that there. Boom. We're going to have the drone come to do a fair amount of damage for us anyway. We've got a more powerful one of these. Let's do a pacifist smash. Then we'll do a fire damage. Why not? Just kind of get it on the go. Activate droid ability now. Do a nice attack to all party members. Damage all enemies. Infix disarm. Also going to be quite good for us. As you can see, that means the attacks are way less effective. A nice attack to these will also do good. Water damage to one. We'll just do a zap here. Deal with the first one of these. And then let's do a heavy damage to a robotic enemy. Because why not? Uh, bum, bum, bum. One pierce damage. 
one more to damage. And then surely Chill Vial should deal the final blow there for us. Examine. Place the bot tree in the blue spot. So we're going to have to get the yellow spot. A door did open here. Can this now open for us? No. Okay. Good to know. Good to know. So there must be a door, however, up here that we can now open. That one seems blocked. We obviously know these crypts. Take the yellow battery. Place the battery in this slot. Let's go here and make sure we see what's on available to us. Found a flask, a weapon for a tail that boots up ice damage and damage against robotic enemies. I think we're definitely going to be equipping that flask here. We certainly are, look at that, so much more damage. Also, her ice will come in handy against the upcoming enemies, I'm sure. So that appears to be everything in this area, so let's go on up and ahead. Okay, what are we up against here? We are up against an infected Hinks by the looks of it. Who is weak to fire. Okay. You know what? We'll start with a sea storm. Then we'll do a randomly generated amount of damage. We will start our ice attack. We will do a fire onto you. My guess is that Sybe's going to become a party member as well. We'll do a pierce damage to you because we're going to have an extra powerful one. And then let's do an Enviro hack because I've always enjoyed these. Let's see what we actually have an offer for us. There's a heal with the Enviro hack. That is very nice, actually. Um, fuck, fuck it, we'll do a Hall of Shot, even though it's not going to do any more damage. But it's still fairly powerful, actually. Which is good to see. More ice damage here. We'll do a Pacifist Smash. Give ourselves a booting up clearance here. Then a Molotov. So there we go. Easily done. My god, there's actually an upstairs. How very interesting. Let's go straight forward though. Let's check out all possible routes. Hmm. Can we interact with any of these? These have got one yellow... Examine. Primary hyper system in Kudamore. Eliminate threats and repair primary antenna systems. Okay. So it seems like we've got to grab a blue and a yellow for that. We want to heal the hive mind. Are we going to liberate the hive? That's incredible if we do. Uh, right. Let's see what we've got going on here. So we've got ourselves a blue. Take the blue battery. Anything else to examine here? Examine. Okay. Incubation system. Pod system offline. Maybe I should put that back. Okay, I can't. <laughs> That's fine. We knew it would be offline. So many of these pods here. Activate. Dropping treasure chest to lower level. Interesting. Let's go get that. <laughs> the lower level in my brain would be right here, correct? Is that where it's dropped? Or is it going to be the lowest level? No! That's confusing. Perhaps it's more at up at the actual uh, a different place in the system's upgrade area. So let's go up this way. Sorry guys, I took you on a little little tour for nothing. This way we go. So let's go forward and see what we got ahead of us. These ones are weak to fire, right? Let's fuck them up with this, uh, the storm anyway. We haven't looked at what Finn's one is actually, so I should probably look at that. Do a randomly generated number attack. 58, that's annoying. Uh, fire. Fire. What's the program here? Fin absorb force field. 
Fin Burst absorb one hit. It's pretty good. Uh, but we'll do this because we've got more powerful one. Should be more than enough for us. And then we can do a Incinerate. Let's just do a beam attack. Get that on the go. Flawless shot. Bash your boy. Do a nice damage and then we'll do a shot there. Uh, so there we go. Easily done. And we get some levels up too. Okay, there seems to be droppers here. Maybe this is where we need to go in order to get that dropped. Treasure chest? Hmm. Ghost headband, excessively charm the piece of damage. I did not see that at all. That's interesting. Uh, right, this way we go. Is there a yellow battery here for us? No. We should go check whether or not we can manipulate that terminal, though. Conveyor system currently offline. Okay, let's fight this thing, though. Let's get these guys out of the water. Um, so, they're weak to fire and water, but we'll do the randomly generated number first. We'll do a pierce damage to you. My god, Finn might actually be able to use his extra powerful... Double attack opening shot. Flawless shot if HP's user is max. Yes. Nice. It does a cool, cool, cool a thousand, which is actually really good. Um, we'll do a fire. Do an extra powerful star storm. My god, that was powerful. Jesus Christ. Uh, we'll do an ice damage to you because it's an extra powerful one, so we might as well make use of that. And then we'll just do a dual damage with Finn. There we go. No new abilities land, but Arted has leveled up. So, let's go this way. Interesting. Is there a secret passageway here or something? Is there a secret passageway here or something? No, no, no. I mean, we got the ghost headband. But there doesn't appear to be much here for us there. Let's try this way. We'll do the randomly generated number there. Let's do a pierce there. We'll do a fire vial there. We'll do the flawless shot to the guy with full health there. Nicely done. And then we'll bring ourselves back up to scratch in a second. La 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 la. Inflict stun on all enemies. Let's try this out. It's a new one. Fuck it, we're going to do this. Extra powerful Star Storm. We'll do the drain attack there. Fire all enemies. Get disarmed. That is actually very handy, to be actually, to be honest. We'll do a fire to you, because it's going to be extra powerful. Nicely done. A water damage to all enemies. Just because it takes out some of them. Let's go ahead and activate the drone ability now, because these things are weak to ice anyway. Then we'll just do a shoot. And that should deal with it. Nicely done. Our tech's cool because you kind of just, it's basically like a setting up thing. Primary hive system critical, eliminate threats and repair antennae systems. Right, what I can do here then is do this. You hear loud noise from the room to the east. Interesting. Interesting indeed.
But it feels like I need to get that yellow one from downstairs, maybe? Because this takes us up to the next level, but that's not necessarily what I want. Because there's definitely a space here for a yellow. Hmm. I'm going to go downstairs and see if I can grab that yellow one from the stop. If that makes sense. I'll see you in a sec. So it said it was damaged, so I couldn't get it. So let's just go ahead. And if we find a yellow, we're going to take it back, obviously. Like, can I grab this one? Dropping battery to lower level. Dropping treasure chest to lower level. Okay. Can I take this out? No. So let's find the treasure chest first. Captain Badge, accessory for singers and a defensive stance at the start of each battle. That's fine. Take the yellow battery. What's going to open though? Okay, let's get the yellow battery into here. You hear a loud noise from the room to the east. Okay, that's now locked for us, apparently. That's interesting. Okay, this is now blocked for us. Uh, these are all weak to fire. Let's do a randomly generated number of damage. Do a shitstorm. Do the beam attack. Okay, okay. Rambat depends on locale. We don't need to do that right now. What we do can what we can do is try and take these things out with fire, so let's do that. We got an extra strong one here. Still water damage to all enemies, because it's gonna be but plus that was shite. Oh my god, that was shite. Uh fire damage. Let's take out the Gaunt Scrim X first. Then we'll do a damage to all of enemies. Effect disarm. Definitely seems like a good idea to me. They're all going all out on Finn. That's fine, as the drone's going to come and do some damage here as well. We've got a more powerful program here. Take out the one that's nearest to you. We're going to focus our attacks onto the next guy now. We've got a program here, so let's go ahead and use a Molotov on you. That's okay. Because this can go ahead and fire up there. Takes two of them out. We'll just do a water damage to you. Then a final blow. Boom, boom, boom. Did we go through here? Yes, we did. What we couldn't do is, yeah, that moved, but this was the way that we came here. Just want to double check. <laughs> okay, cool. Now I understand. That's all good. Let's make our way up here. So it's probably going to be the proper area next. Examine danger. Significant threat detection in primary antenna room. Okay. And I'm guessing that this is the primary antenna room. I don't feel so well. What the fuck? Given. Humanity is nothing but a foolish concept. We've become so much more. What the fuck is this? This isn't a so beautiful sight. Why not stay here? No, this is not real. It's an illusion. How amusing. Most humans don't see past the evidence in their eyes, no matter. 
you too will succumb. Okay, this is the thing. The nightmare. If you die in a dream, you die in real life. How very, very fun. What are you weak to? Fire, ice, and water. That's fine. We'll do start off with a, a RNG. Uh, then we'll do a party program so everyone's programs go up. Why not? So we can do a better shitstorm when we do it. And then let us get the ice attacks on the go. Flawless shot. Still does a decent amount of damage, you know. Style down. Style down. That is fine with us. Let's go ahead and use our program. Seeing as now we've got more powerful ones. 49. Uh, we'll do a pacifist just because the guy is not weak on life yet. Um, a fire damage to you. More powerful fire damage. 1997. Very, very nice. We'll do the same with you. All the Molotovs. An ice damage coming in. A more powerful one of these is incoming. No, you know what? We're going to use the lightning attack. We'll pierce here for one. A acid vial there. A fire damage to a small area from Finn. That's all good. We can use the Enviro hack next anyway, as this still is dealing a hella, hella amount of damage. Star down. Right, let's go to Enviro hack. Hopefully this heals us like was the case in the last one. It does appear it's that way. That is good. Um, we've got a power program up, so let's go ahead and use the Shitstorm now. 2000. Very nice. Uh, we'll take this here. Do that ice attack. But we've got to disarm, so this is not going to do as much damage, but that's fine. Let's inflict vulnerable. Ooh! Double damage. Nice. What a perfect mix there, as the nightmare is defeated. Uh, revives ally. If style over 100, and uses all styles to heal. That's nice. Next program has double strength. No abilities you learn. No new abilities learned. Visionary. Okay. Is this a new team member we're getting? I would like that. That would be cool. I'm Saib. It's good to see you have survived the Dark Sod. Would have helped if I could have. Are you the one who stole the Lumina device? It is as you say. Take it. Human who resisted such an e a son of evil will make a worthy guardian. Why well, stole the device and only to return it? I knew it. I, I not. I knew not that you would escape. Besides, I would bring you here. Hope you realize the depths of the danger. It's not only a man that wishes to use the device for vile purposes. What was that thing? Dark energy drawn by the power of the hive, seeking to use the Lumina device to impose its will on mortals. Sadly, I fear this is not the only Lunia device. Through the hive, I detect disturbing signals from the planet of Nulap. We must investigate, but not rashly. We must be prepared. Is it true that you have a counter device? It is true. The true counter is the hive. The hive is operational. My people can disrupt the Lunia device wherever it may be. I have begun repairs in the hive, but it will take time. With nine mergers built, my people will see to it. In the meantime, I have a more limited counter. A small device that will protect an individual. With the proper materials, I can produce enough to protect you and your crew. We must go to Zanzar and Mines. Then let's not waste any time. Cyber's joined our team. The Zazari Mines to the southeast, past the Cursed Lab, housed in a loom device. The area is filled with dangerous souls of the Cursed Dead. The danger is high, but we must proceed. And like that, we have a new party member who's taken Art out the out the team. But you know what? We'll, we'll stick with that. Uh, but I think this is a good place to say. If you've enjoyed this episode, please like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time on Cosmic Star Heroin. Peace.